The collection is largely of 19th century pictures, Victorian pictures, and it belongs to the Forbes family. It's a collection that's been put together over the last 40 years, particularly driven by the third son, Christopher Forbes, and it encapsulates almost the entire range of painting between about 1840 and 1900. It would be lovely to be able to say that this was one of the great collections of 19th century paintings, but of course, in the 19th century, many very wealthy industrialists put together magnificent collections that are now housed in the great city art galleries of Manchester, of Liverpool and Birmingham. And in more recent years, Andrew Lloyd Webber, in almost exactly the same time frame as Christopher Forbes, has put together a most remarkable collection. But this collection is perhaps the most broadly based, covers the greatest number of painters, and in many ways is the most fascinating of all collections. They have very good relations with the big auction houses and have used them in the past. They've sold a number of collections that their late father, the publishing magnate Malcolm Forbes, put together in his lifetime. Um, they used one of the big auction houses to negotiate a private sale of their world-famous Fabergé collection to a private Russian collector. But in this particular instance, they feel that we are taking individual pictures which need to be fitted to individual collectors and it's something that's more appropriately done through a dealer. The Fine Art Society has been dealing with the family since 1968 and we feel both flattered and pleased that they've chosen us to handle it.